His family describes him as quiet and kind hearted. Tonight, loved ones are talking publicly for the first time about 16 year old Vontre Spanner. The young man was shot and killed in Fort Pierce a week and a half ago in front of his home. Ari Height talked with Banner's grandmother about her loss and her plea to the community. The St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office continues to investigate this shooting, continues to look for the people responsible for killing this 16 year old boy. And now for the first time, that young man's family is talking publicly about who they lost and they have a message for the community. His name was Vontrez Banner, only 16 years old, getting ready to start his junior year of high school. Because he wanted to make his mom proud, his dad proud, his family proud, and that's what he told me last. On July 17th, Vontrez was getting the mail at his home on Juanita Street. Investigators with the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office say someone from a passing car opened fire, shooting Vontrez and killing him. It's been really hard because we are so close. Vontrez was very close. In the nearly two weeks since his death, Joanne Brunson has been cherishing her memories of Vontrez, hearing him talk about his love of sports, spending time with him at church. And when church was over, he would holler, Grandmother, can I, um, can I beat the drums? Can I beat the drums? I said, sure, baby, sure. The sheriff's office has located the vehicle used in the drive-by shooting. It's a 2016 Chevy Cruze with a dent on the side. But the shooter or shooters remain at large. Brunson knows nothing can ever bring back her grandson, but she wants an arrest made. She wants anyone with information to step forward. She wants justice for Von Trez. Let your heart speak and do what's right because justice is and it will come from God. I'm going to miss my baby. That's my baby. I'm going to miss him very much. Again, the people responsible for killing Von Trez Banner remain at large. If you can help the sheriff's office find those people, please give them a call. In Fort Pierce, Ari Hyde, WPBF 25 News.